please click on the YouTube subscribe button to get updates as we release new videos. Scott Walker and his big business backers are running a campaign about the so-called reforms of over the last year, and they're calling it, It Is Working. <laughs> you need to look no further than the private sector job losses over the last year to know that it is not working. <clears throat> Scott Walker promised that state government would focus on job creation, and he's failed. And we've learned last week that thousands of Wisconsinites are losing their extended unemployment benefits. These people need jobs right away. What can you do as governor to help, and what will you do to help? Senator Ryan, up here first. Thank you, thank you very much. We need a different way to do jobs. What we're doing is not working. Investment in human potential is key to economic growth. Last year, Wisconsin had the largest per capita cut to education and we lost more jobs than any other state. There's a connection. Millions were cut from our tech colleges and now companies can't find workers. There's a connection. The, like the rest of the country, we're facing that mini wave of manufacturing, increased return of jobs. Companies are looking to hire, but they can't find workers. I, live, I represent Eau Claire. I live near Eau Claire one of the lowest unemployment rates in the state, except Dan Kelly. When I listen to why businesses come to Eau Claire, what they talk about is good schools, a great UW system and tech college system that work with the businesses, hand in hand, a trained workforce, a transportation system, a clean environment, jobs, education, and great places to live all go together. Government has to do a job in providing public service so that businesses can continue to function. We need to invest in our transportation and communication system. We don't have broadband in my world. The governor sent back that money. We need to help businesses get off the ground. We need to help them find access to capital. And if we want the economy to thrive, we have to restore the cuts to tech colleges and to our K-12 system and to our UW system. Because you know what's being cut? Business education agriculture, vocational education, welding, and training for nurses. This is where the jobs are, and people can't get into these programs, or the schools have lost them. We need a balance. The private sector provides the jobs, but the public sector provides the support. Thank you, Senator Reynolds. Thank you. This is just a quick answer but there's a whole lot more information on my website at KathleenFinehout.org. Please share this video on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and email. Early voting has started. Contact your clerk. You can vote right now.